Good morning, children. How are you all? I hope you all are fine and getting geared up for your vacations, right? You have seen all the videos before, yes. Now, I hope you have understood them, yes. So, again, I am Neelam teacher here. Today, I am going to tell you about the English project. Right, you've got projects in all the subjects, but I'll be telling you about English project. In the last video, I had showed you, I had taught you about singular and plural. I'm sure you have understood the concept. So, this project is based on that. Now, you'll make a cover page. On that, you will write your name, full name. Roll number, previous roll number which you had in your class, standard will be second and division the previous old one, right? Subject, English, school, Srima Vidyale and topic is plurals, topic is plurals. Yes, now I will tell you in detail and give you an idea about how to do the English project. Now, you have to make my plurals book. My plurals book. We had learned how from singular it is changed to plural. In which words we add S, in which we add e ES and in some we add IES. So, in that plural work book, you have to write 10 nouns ending with S, again 10 nouns ending with ES and 10 nouns ending with IES. That means on the whole 30, 10, 10, 10. Now in that you can draw the pictures or if you can't draw, if you have some pictures, you can take out from old magazines or newspaper. And you can stick it right now I'm just giving you an idea how you can make the project <coughs> now this is a calendar this calendar I have showed you in the slide also yes so you can use this to make your project if you don't have it never mind if you want you can Find someone and take it from your friends or anyone in the building. Yes, if you don't have that, never mind. You can use wall calendars also, right? Or you can use <coughs> notebooks also. Spiral ones, good, very good. If not, even the simple ones can be used. Then, this is a old diary. You can ask your father if he's got an old di diary, you can make it that also, right? Now, I will tell you how to do your project. So, supposing you have picked up an old diary or a book, you just cover it and write my plural, plurals book. And on the first page, as I had mentioned before, name, class, roll number, school, everything has to be mentioned. Then, from the second page, we will start with the content. Now, here, yeah, you divide it, the papers, into three portions, into three portions. Just cut it twice, so it will become into three portions. So, on the first flap, you write S and you'll be making nouns. Yes, ending with S. Second one, ES. You'll write words ending with ES. Third, IES. Here you will write words ending with IES. Yes. Now, these are the flaps. Like these, you have to make 10, 10 flaps in all three. I've just shown you an example just for you all to get an idea. So on the top you write singular also after that 
you draw the pictures and you write plural like supposing cat you make two cats three cats if you want to draw it very well and good otherwise you can stick pictures also and write the correct spelling c a t s similar in the second slot you write bus draw buses and write b u s e s similar in the third one cherry make cherries and write the spelling c h e r r i e s so remember there has to be three flaps right and 10 10 of each here these these are the same examples i have repeated again in the first one cat draw cats and write cats in the second flap write bus draw buses and write buses in the third one write cherry draw or stick pictures of cherries and write spelling of cherries c h e r r i e s with this i think you have got got a brief idea as how to do the project right so now you don't worry whatever material you have with have at house like old papers or all or, or old notebooks you can use them you can stick new plain papers on that and start doing your drawing and writing on that you can use your old drawing books also now remember children this project has to be done by you in your handwriting right if you want you can take help from your parents i know it will be difficult for you all to do it alone so please take help of them in drawing and sticking and <clears throat> you can if if you don't have spiral books you can just pick up the papers and staple them on top and and make it like a book <clears throat> and then you can make the flaps or you you can just punch those papers and tie them with a ribbon but remember you have to make it like a book book and it should have flaps so that you go on seeing them i hope i i am very clear and one thing more i want to clear please this project has to be done compulsory it is compulsory for all the students because you will get marks on that so do it very neatly and slowly we put enough time so don't worry children yes now regarding the submission of the, of the project the submission of the project will be done once the school reopens once the school reopens so i think i'm quite clear and i've made the concept about how to do the project right so once again enjoy children have a good time be safe be healthy and hope to meet you all soon thank you